the airport. <laughs> it's time to fit our food somehow in this. I did fill my coins. Hi guys. Um, I sent Yaz on a challenge with how much did I give you? Five. Five dollars ninety cents. That's all I have left in coins and cash. Um, and she's about to show me what she's bought. So I'm really excited. Vending machine. I did see you having a play with the vending. <laughs> the twirl breakaway. It's been talking about breakaways the whole I time. I have. I have. Then so that's fantastic. I got two lemonade chop chop because. <laughs> and then more. That left me. No, no. That's all I could get. <laughs> <laughs> and then I kept 10 cents each to put in like our scrapbook or memory books and then the remaining 70 cents I put in the charity pot. Oh, I'm a good that's good, that's nice. So yeah, you And there's two things between each one, so one each. Yes, I'm really excited about this lolly. Yeah, lemonade. I was wondering what to get, so I'll get two different, but then what if we then can't decide? And this, this looks oh. fun. Really, really getting my breakaway fix there. Fantastic, well, good work. These. I kept the shiny ones. Um, yeah, sure. <laughs> Precious cargo in hand. We've had a very productive few hours planning Oz. Um, we're going when it's Christmas and busy season. So we've been busy booking hostels. It's freezing as well. But what a way to leave New Zealand. Transfer time. <laughs> Morning vlog. Welcome to Ken. And sunshine, look at our outfits. The difference of these in the last like three weeks, it's mental. Jumpers My hair, however, is really greasy, really disgusting, so we've slicked it back into a pony. No parting, we don't want to burn today. The UV rate is what, Rachel? 14. Yeah. Danger. Um, we've Danger. had a lovely lie in because we got in at like one, yeah. but in, or well, like quarter past one, but New Zealand time, that was like 4 a.m. 4 a.m. So, not the vibes. Um, so yeah, we're very tired this morning. We just had a, we're just planning a chill day. We're going to get some breakfast now. Um, go back, fill our water bottles up, and get our bags ready. And we're just going to have a wander. Oh, we're going to get our nails done because they are rank. Yeah, trust that. We're going to get our nails done because they're disgusting. And then just go sit by the pool, we think. Pure joy, I tell you, pure joy. Stopped up well. Oh, the mango, can't wait for that. I just made our lunch. Look at the sun. <laughs> we were just laying outside in the sun. Of course, where would we be? It's a bit of book club time. This is the book that I'm reading now. Rachel read this first, so now I'm reading it. Um, I was going to say, yeah, we were laying for about maybe a, maybe a good hour, 45 minutes. I had a nice dip. Yeah, Rachel's right, been in the, in the pool, pool aqua, in the obviously. lagoon over there. But it's just started to spit with rain a bit. And the weather forecast hasn't been good. Um, even though it's still like 30 odd degrees, yeah, it's meant to rain quite a lot this week. So that's a shame. But we were just saying a lot of the trips that we're going on are water based. So it's not the end of the world if it, just, it does rain. Obviously, we don't want it to rain, but it's fine. We've just retreated under these picnic benches where they've got like little um, roofs. <laughs> And we're gonna have some nibbles. I yeah, really, really want to try this beast. Yeah, we're gonna have some nibbles. We've got some uh, carrot sticks, tomatoes, and cucumber. We've got some pizza bread that we chopped up. And we've got this dip. How's it smelling? Smells good. The dip was absolutely sensational. It's some kind of sweet potato, I don't know, kind of dip. I don't know why they don't do something like this in England because it's so good. After lunch, the weather still didn't clear up, so we decided to head to the mall, get our nails done, and do a little bit of shopping. Shock horror, look where we are again. Choosing our snackage for the evenings. I've gone for a caramel twirl, which I've already tried, but I really enjoyed. A dream white chocolate, and then we've got some chocolate almonds. Rach is thinking about sweet. She's got a caramel bar, and now she can't decide what else she wants. 
don't know if you can see this, but it's literally tipping it down with rain. Yay, love that bra. Look what I'm wearing. Oh, zoom. Morning vlog. It's still raining here in Thames. But well, we're going to a ward for today, so hopefully it won't matter too much. I tried out some um, heatless curls on my hair last night using my pillowcase. This side, a bit questionable. This side, I mean, it doesn't look great on the camera, but it's giving my hair some texture. Although it's probably going to get flat in about one minute of walking to the bus stop to get the shuttle bus to the trip. It's not quite the um, sunshine we hoped for, but hopefully it's going to clear up or wherever we're going um, won't matter without the rain. <laughs> It is a bit chillier up here than it was at the last waterfall. That's gonna feel freezing in there. How cold is it, Hen? I like <laughs> Go for it. Better? <laughs> Swim. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> It's a random looking pub that we're in. <laughs> so we've um, had our lunch, now we're on our way to the next stop. And then we're going to sleep stop. <laughs> Rachel shit herself because, well, all I could see was this tail bit at first. They're so still, look. Lizzy boo. <laughs> So we just walked past the um, lizard again and it moved, <laughs> but we forgot where it was. Yeah. And just the grass or like the leaves rummage, you do kind of panic because you think, is it a snake? No, just a lizard. Um, we yeah, are yeah. at the last stop of the day for our tour today called Lake Eacham. And we've just been and looked at the turtles. I'm gonna go for a little dip. It's actually quite warm now, like really? even though it was chucking it down this morning. We've had quite a nice day because we've been in and out of the water. It's not really massive that it's been raining, so that's good. Mm. Oh, Bob just landed like a horse. Where my go? <laughs> Hello. 
Hello vlog. vlog. Um, we've got back from our waterfall tour. It was a lovely day, ended up being a lovely day. We just had a shower, although like, hair is minging yeah, from the amount of mank places we've been in today. Um, rivers and creeks, lovely times. Um, but we're not washing the hair because we washed it last night. Anyway, today is the 1st of December. Um, and <laughs> Sorry, I'm having my privacy card. My dad. I was sent um, some cards and gifts from my parents and grandparents before I left. Um, and I also sent them, not sent them, but I gave them a box of biscuits and a card to open them on the 1st of December. So I've just had this video from my nan, and she won't mind me showing this because I, yeah, she basically I sent me a whole me. unboxing video opening their card and their gift on WhatsApp. It was two and a half minutes long, and it was absolutely hilarious to make my Vlog day. Vlog sensations. Yeah, they're the next vlog sensations. So anyway, we're going to open what they've got us and, and they've they've got rach one too do you want to open the pudding one and i'll open oh they're both coming in obviously classic nan rose style nan it's rose in Brenda. a napkin a lovely festive napkin nonetheless oh thanks nan oh thanks a little, little a felt festive character to put on our backpack you feel like i've been accepted into the family as the adopted <laughs> granddaughter i'll send them a picture That's of that up. in a minute okay next this is from my mother my Open me on 1st of December. Well, today is the 1st of December, Mother. Oh, classic. She loves one of these. Hope you're having the most amazing time. A little something to count down December with. Lots of love. Mum and Dad slash Debbie and Gary. <laughs> yes! <laughs> it's a, um, an advent calendar card. So we've got something to open every day. We're going out for dinner tonight with um, Rachel's friend. No, Rachel's my cousin's friend. friend who lives in Cairns. We'll catch I, you up. My friend. When we're going there later and see what we have. We're not really tanned yet, but Rachel's we're, we're getting there. This is Rachel's skirt that she's bought um, in Cotton On. Cotton on. My top I bought in Glassons in New Zealand. We're heading for some dinner now. In ravenous. I'm we're ravenous. hungry, yeah. We're we want crunchy spring roll. We're going to, we think it's a Japanese, Japanese place, but we've seen on the menu spring rolls. Edamame, Edamame num -num. beans. Our favourite things in the world. Num -num -num. <laughs> got a lovely trip to the Great Barrier Reef tomorrow and we've been looking at the weather all day because oh. it was meant to rain the whole time we're in Cairns which is a real shame. It was looking up the last time we looked so fingers crossed it stays nice. It's not been raining anymore this evening so it's it's gonna be good. Manifesting good times. Unlike last time I am gonna take my seasickness tablets before I get on the boat because last time it was a lovely two hour drive out to the reef and I threw up the whole time. So yeah, if you don't think you have seasickness, take a seasickness tablet anyway because it's honestly not worth that, right? <laughs>
salad bar. Oh, we've got lunch. Just been out to fantastic time. It is quite windy today, so the current was on the race of prawns with full on. I was going to have the prawns when he said the prawns were over, but I'm not a fish eater really, like at all basically. But they got heads on, so I'm a bit scared. Yeah, it was a bit windy out there. The current was quite strong. Kept feeling like I was like swimming into you. Yeah. And I was like really then sorry. Laugh. No, then I was just laugh. So I was like, Me and water, it's just chaos. Just complete chaos. Um, yeah, I had a great time. And now I'm having some lunch, just starving. It feels a bit strange editing this video back just because I remember my time in Cairns the first time I went so clearly. I feel so lucky that I get to see the Great Barrier Reef again because it's just such a magical place. My swimming skills have absolutely not improved in the last few years, however that never takes away from the beauty of this place and how much you can see just by floating around at the surface of the ocean. In some parts the coral is a lot closer to you because the water's not as deep and yeah you can see so much, it's really cool. Do a little bit of shopping for dinner and look what we found. What? Look at the view for tonight's dinner. And this is what we got tonight. A little couscous, chickpeas, salad. on Fitzroy Island. A bit of a grey cloud above and it's spitting a little bit but it's boiling hot sun so it should be all good. Before chilling out for the day we decided to take a walk up to the lighthouse however you will see in a minute how this went. This is as high up as we can manage today. So hot my backpack literally has sweat on it but looks pretty stunning. it's just so steep oh god i can feel the sweat dripping yeah I'm from dripping. this part of my neck <laughs> ew i can't actually take my hat off because <laughs> if i took the hat off it would be offensive it would be like a banana water <sighs> After we admitted defeat on the lighthouse walk, we decided to walk around to Nudie Beach where we spent most of the day just chilling out, reading our books, eating our packed lunch, having a nap and taking some photos. What else are you meant to do when you're fun employed and travelling? so much for watching this vlog of my time in Cairns if you enjoyed please remember to subscribe and like this video I'll see you next time where we head to Magnetic Island <laughs>